So here I have two sides of a triangle, so I want to find the range of possible values for the third side. So what I'm going to have to do is use the triangle inequality that tells me if I sum any two sides, then that sum should be greater than the third side. So that means 36 plus 48 should be greater than the third side, which I'm going to represent by the variable x. Also, if I add either of these with the variable x, it should be greater than the other. So 36 plus x should be greater than 48, and 48 plus x should be greater than 36. Well, this is always going to be true for any value of x, since x has to be positive, because it represents the length of a side. So this is always true, so we don't need to use this one. But we will use these two. This one is 36 plus 48, so it says 84 needs to be greater than x. And this one, if I subtract 36 from both sides, I'll get x needs to be greater than 12. Okay, so 84 is greater than x, and x is greater than 12. So if I were to write this in a compound inequality, I'd have 12 is less than x, which is less than 84. So x needs to be between 12 and 84 um, exclusively. It cannot equal 12 and it cannot equal 84.